Hello, Vic. I'm Pi. We're in Pi. We're in DJ Hostel. D E E J A I. God damn. It's like a real hippie area and a hippie hostel. I mean, look at that. That's far. So we're up in the mountains now. We're up in the high country of Thailand. Yeah, this place they do like ice bars, they do women's circles, men's circles. Um, you get the vibe. Mushies, brownies on top. Yoga every morning, ice baths, a DJ workshop. Got myself a lemongrass tea, and I've got a ten herbs tea, Thai herbs. Buddha blood tea. Just uh, smoked a bong. Now we're off to a waterfall. Look at this, mate. It doesn't get much better than this, does it? traveling at all unless they're in the resorts but like they're definitely in the resorts we think we think the weed might be uh, repelling them away from Thailand boomer free zone really and there's too many steps everywhere it's literally 
Like for everything, you need to climb some steps all the time. Victoria got sick again, just a one day, 24 hour bug. Yeah. I was trying to get her to come and do the canyon at least for the sunset yesterday. And um, went there, got the drone up. And while we're on this cliff, she starts vomiting into a bush. And then the drone comes down. And I didn't say anything about grabbing it. And she just like swings at it to try to catch it. Because if you catch it quickly and you turn it around really quickly, it kills, like it, that's how you stop it. Or you can just land it like a normal person. But Vic just fucking swung at it and just punched the drone and just cut up all the fingers. <laughs> just started bleeding instantly. And, um, and then vomited more. <laughs> So we just stayed in this place here for about an hour, beer.ba, um, and they're a local weed, like all the weed dealership weed. and plantation farming and like yeah. all of it. They do all the work. All the, all, yeah, all the like weed. Like a brewery. They sell in there. It's a brewery. Yeah, it's like all the weed they sell. They mm. grow themselves. Good review. Say. Ten out of ten. Yeah. I can't wait till there's like places like that in Melbourne. That'd be cool. Just a bong sitting there, come and just try out a couple a couple strains, walk home, no worries. St. Kilda, 100%, that's where it's going to be happening. Give it two years. <laughs> 